personally, uh, what, what have you done well? Uh, obviously, the team's off to a good start, but, but where are you personally? How do you feel like you're playing? Um, I think I'm doing pretty good. Um, Hitting-wise, I'm struggling a little bit. I've been streaky. Uh, I'll go get two or three hits a game, and then next game I'll go over. But it's slowly um, seeing the ball a little, better, a little bit better from sophomore year. Um, I want to improve on that, but I think defensively I'm doing a lot really good, actually, defensively. Um, but hitting, I definitely want to start getting more productive every game instead of, you know, every other game. Yeah, how, how does that happen? How do, how do you become a little bit more consistent? What do you need to change? I think just when I'm in the cages hitting, focusing more on, you know, each and everything from T work to soft toss and um, just focusing more when I'm doing the little things. Okay. Uh, what were some of the things you wanted to work on coming into this season, and, and how do you feel like you've progressed in those areas? Um, I would say my throwing motion um, from my surgery. Uh, I've always had a weird motion from football, playing quarterback. And uh, after my surgery, that's one thing I wanted to work on a lot, and I feel like it's gotten a lot better than what it, you know, what it was. You know, talk, talk a little bit about the shoulder injury. How did that happen, and, and you know, what's kind of been the process of, of coming back? Well, uh, Jadavion Clowney got a hold of me my sophomore year, and uh, it, uh, I had surgery last February, so I didn't even play last year. And uh, it's pretty. It's gone, gone pretty good. I, let's see, it's been it's been a year and two months now, and it's got. I feel like it gets stronger every week. So um, my emotions getting a lot better, and it's getting a lot stronger. So. All right. And what what are some of the things that you're kind of focused on? We talked about some hitting consistency, but as far as you know, getting to Clemson next year, what what are some of the things you you want to work on between now and then? Uh, I definitely want to get faster. That's, I think that's one thing I, I really need to work on. Uh, I got pretty quick feet, but just, just running uh, running the bases, I want to get faster. And, and we, we talked a little bit about Clemson. Kind of tell us how the recruiting process went for you. I know it's been over for a while, and you're signed and, and ready to go. But what, take us back to the rec- recruiting process for you. Um, I would say it started, it started the summer going into my sophomore year, and – LaCroix came and watched me at one of our games my sophomore year, and he followed me on into that summer. And, um, you know, my whole family went to Clemson. My grandfather went there. My uncle played there. Both my parents went there. My sister's there now. And, you know, I've been in love with Clemson since I was a kid. And as soon as they started recruiting me, I knew that's where I wanted to go. So. And what kind of interaction have you have you had lately with the coaches? What what have they had to say to you about you know what they expect to see out of you this year, and and then and more importantly next year at, at Clemson? Well, they're really just encouraging me to uh, keep working on my arm strength, keep keep getting you know just my feet back under me and everything I do because you know taking a year off it was kind of hard, and they're just being really encouraging to you know getting back to the basics and just having fun, and getting my arm strength back.